now we will set some preferences just go to the option preferences here go to grid display and select this grid spacing to one by two pin to pin spacing next is pan and zoom and set the zoom factor as 1.2 Now click OK. Now go to your data sheet and next we will place these headers here. So go to place part, select all the libraries and search for header 10. Double click it, press R to rotate and place it here. Then press escape. Now search for header 6, next is header 8, and we will place this reference designator close to the connector here, same as this name. Now go to your data sheet and from this data sheet you can see this port is start from PB0 to PB5 but in this symbol this start from PB5 to PB0 so we have to swap the pins. Select the component, right click, edit part. Now first delete all the boundaries, select the boundary, delete it, select this one, delete. Now we will expand this rectangle. Now we will change all these pins. So pin 2 is at the bottom. Next is pin 3. Now same for port C. Now for port B, now adjust the pin from left hand side, reset pin on the top, next is our crystal pins, next we will place the VCC, next is analog VCC analog reference here and the ground pin now we will place a boundary on this just go to the place a rectangle click on the first point and drag the rectangle to the other side now right click and close it update all yes now we can connect all these header with this microcontroller. Good wire, 